Hey everybody, what is going on? I hope you guys are all doing well and welcome to another tutorial video. In this video, I'll be explaining to you guys how you can possibly stabilize a video in Clipchamp. So let's get right into it. Now, Clipchamp does not at the moment have a stabilization feature, not even for the free version and not for the premium version as well. So technically you cannot do it uh, originally. Well, as you would imagine it, there is an alternative, which I will show you guys, even though it is a very bad alternative and your video will look bad uh, and it is very difficult to achieve. Uh, but I will explain it to you guys just so you have some other well idea which you can use however I would recommend that you use other editing software to do this simply because it is better and it'll do a much better job but pretty much if you're editing a video and your video is shaky this video is just a static screen capture but for example let's say you're filming something and it is shaky what you're gonna need to do uh, is pretty much just minimize the video and move it around uh, depending on the pivot point that you choose uh, and you're gonna have to do it frame by frame however even if I move it around as you can see uh, it is still in the same place for the whole duration of the video so what you're gonna have to do is pretty much frame frame by frame snip this video into smaller portions and then uh, each portion you're gonna have to move to the appropriate place as you can see uh, it changes spots when I go through with the marker but uh, as I've said it is very tedious you're gonna have to go through it frame by frame and even still if you do it and you achieve it uh, somehow uh, it's still gonna be uh, well like this it'll be one small video uh, display over a black background since it does not have a background and it'll, it will not stretch to the entire aspect ratio so you're kind of out of luck when it comes to that but if you do actually insist on doing this in Clipchamp that is the only way in which you can do it there is no other way so I would recommend that you guys use something else such as Premiere Pro or some other editing software Sony Vegas maybe etc etc uh, that's pretty much it hope you guys enjoyed and I'll be seeing you guys in another video